In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create this animation that we see right here, this lower third, and we're going to do everything in Canva. So if you guys are interested in this tutorial, let's go to my computer. Here we are in the Canva homepage and for this project in particular, let's go to video and then select the first option that says video 1920 by 1080. Here we are in the Canva editor and now let's start creating the lower third design. So for this I will bring a rectangle to my page and I will do it by pressing R, the key R, and then here we have a rectangle that I will use to hold my text. So in the first rectangle I'm going to add my name and I will add a text box by pressing the key T. Here we have a text box. So now I'm going to change the text for my name. If you want you can change the font as well. Let's use this one right here. I will put the text box on top of the rectangle. Now select both elements and by pressing option or alt let's click and drag these elements to the side to create a duplicate. In the second text box I'm going to add my role. In this case I'm going to add a Canva certified creative because I am a Canva certified creative and for this text to be aligned to the one on top I'm going to decrease the size of this second text box maybe like this and then I will change the color of the text box that is holding the Canva certified creative text box. So let's go to color and let's say that I will go for a black and then white for the text box. You can adjust the elements or the size of the elements if you wish. I think I will go for this layout and to add something more interesting to this lower third I'm going to add animations. So let me click on the text box that holds my name and then go to animate. Here we are in the text animations so you can add any of these animations these animations are free. The only ones that are available for Canva Pro users are the one with the crowns. So let me see what can look interesting. I really like this one. Yeah, I'm going to go for bounce for my name and then for the Canva certified creative. Let's use a different animation. Let me see what can look uh, good. I'm just going to hover my mouse on top of all the different animations to preview and see what looks better. Okay, I think I'm gonna go for black for the second text box and now I will add another set of animations but this time I'm going to add the animations to the boxes or the rectangles that are behind my name and the Canva certified creative. So by selecting the rectangle let's go to animate once again but this time make sure that says element animations. If it says text animations then you have selected the text box and not the rectangle so make sure to select the rectangle and then you will be able to add an animation to the rectangle. I think this one that says pan because it's coming from the left to the right is going to look nice and for the black one I think we can also use the pan animation. So we have the animation ready. Now how do we insert these to our YouTube videos let's say. I'm going to change the color in the background and I'm going to select a green color. Now let's download this animation. I'm going to select MP4 video, download it. And once you have this video downloaded into your computer, you are going to remove the green background using a video software. In this case, I will remove it with Adobe Premiere Pro. So let me show you really quickly how to do it. 
Here I have the animation that we just created in Canva. So I'm just dragging it inside Adobe Premiere Pro. I have my sequence right here. Then I'm just going to drag this animation on top of my talking head. And let's go to effects. Let's go to ultra key, insert this effect into my animation. And then you see here, ultra key, key color, select the color picker and click on the green area. Like this, you have removed the green color from your animation and then you have your lower third ready in your video and if you guys would like to learn how to create these subscribe button animations in Canva I'm going to leave you guys the tutorial over here also if you want to keep learning more about Canva I'm going to leave you guys a link here so you can enjoy for free our 10 Canva courses and lastly if you want to keep learning with our YouTube videos I'm going to leave two tutorials recommended right here I really hope that you liked and enjoyed this video and see you in the next tutorial. Bye!